so far we have discussed about distance displacement speed velocity and acceleration in the beginning of the chapter i told you that we have different types of motions but in that our focus is on linear motion and the linear motion also again we can have two types of motions uniform motion and non uniform motion now coming to uniform motion the name tells the uniform uniform means constant fixed so see this table to understand what is the what is this motion in zero seconds the distance traveled is zero seconds s means distance t means time s slash m distance slash the unit of distance meters time slash s the unit of time seconds yeah so at zero seconds distance is zero means the body is rest state at one second it covered three meters two seconds six meters like that now if you see the time interval from 1 to 2 in 1 second to 2 seconds what is the distance traveled 6 minus 3 so this distance traveled is 3 meters per 1 second now coming to 2 to 3 seconds second second to third second the distance how much distance traveled means 6 meters to 9 meters but distance traveled is not 9 meters distance traveled is 9 minus 6 3 meters again so again, again it is 3 meters in 1 second now from 3 meters to 4 meters 3 seconds to 4 seconds similar 3, sec 3 meters per second so if you observe carefully this body covering equal distances 3 meters 3 meters 3 meters in equal interval of time I mean each one second it's covering 333 three, three. so that's why its speed is 3 meters per second 3 meters per second 3 meters per second so the speed v is constant throughout so uniform motion means the motion motion with constant speed constant speed of course you can say constant velocity if the body is in straight line motion perfect motion with a constant speed or you can say body covers equal distances in equal time intervals equal distances and equal time intervals or the motion with a constant speed and in this example the constant speed is 3 meters per second that is uniform motion now coming to non-uniform motion the opposite of non-uniform motion see the table carefully in 1 to 2 second the distance traveled 3 meters to 4 meters the so distance traveled is 1 meter 1 meter in 1 second now from 2 seconds to 3 seconds the distance travel is 4 to 9 means 9 minus 4 5 meters in 1 second now from 3 to 4 the distance travel 14 minus 9 which is 5 meters in 1 second so what happened here speed is not constant speed is changing so therefore we can say the speed differ v differs so here motion with different speed of course you can add you can say velocity also or body covers unequal distances unequal distances in equal time intervals in equal time intervals sometimes you can say this also body covers equal distances in unequal time intervals either the way it is non-uniform motion so basically you should know that 
the body moves with constant speed in this example 3 meters per second if the body moves with a different speed different speeds like that 1 meters per second 5 meters per second now let me explain you in detail graphically let us take a graph which is having x axis and y axis this is x axis this is y axis this is origin i will take time on x axis and distance in y axis now time 0 1 2 3 4 no so let me locate the times 1 2 3 4 seconds and distance is 3 6 9 12 distances it should be equal distances 3 6 equal space yes now it is little better now 0 seconds 0 distance so first two point is located here ok let me keep like this cross cross is location 0 seconds 0 meters next is 1 second 3 meters 1 second 3 meters see one more plot point is plotted 2 seconds 6 meters right now 3 seconds 9 meters now, similarly if you plot the points yeah so approximately plot the points if you join all the points if you see carefully you will get you will get a straight line a straight line so whenever you see the distance time graph as a straight line without any doubt you can say it is uniform motion it is uniform motion and speed is okay earlier we have calculated 3 meters per second so this type of graph represents uniform motion the line straight line passing through origin now non uniform motion let me draw the same graph with the same rules x time taken in seconds 0 y axis so this is distance in meters time in seconds again locate the times and distances 3 4 no 3 6 9 12 okay, let me extend this 12 15 okay now see what happens 0 0 located 1 is 3 meters 1 is 3 meters 2 is 4 meters 2 4 meters so let us say this is 4 4 meters okay let me plot here 4 meters 3 seconds is 9 meters 3 seconds this is 9 3 seconds plot it 9 meters 4 seconds 14 meters 14 comes here this is 14 14 here so 4 seconds this is the plotted approximately now if you join the points if you observe carefully now this time you are not getting a straight line you are getting a curve that means in a distance time graph whenever you see a curve it is obviously a non uniform motion if you like this video Please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.